from Wiltshire and we're going to tell you all about Crofton Beam Engines. Why was the Kennington Avon Canal built? The Kennington Avon Canal was built in 1794 and finished in 1810. The Kennington Avon Canal transported goods such as coal, wood, stone, bricks, clay, manure and teapots. True or false? There are 87 locks along the canal. Interestingly, true, there are 87 locks. True or false, the canal runs from London to Edinburgh. False, it runs from Bristol to London. The Kennet and Avon Canal was built to transport goods from Bristol to London. In conclusion, the, the Kennet and Avon Canal is one of the most important parts of British history. It commemorates a factor of the Industrial Revolution. In this fascinating video, you will learn about the key events in the history of Crofton Beam Engines. In 1807, work begins at Crofton Pumping Station, and two years later, the first bottom and watt engine is installed. In 1846, major works at Crofton finishes, and ten years later, a new brick chimney is built. In 1959, Crofton chimney is shortened. The engines are retired. Nine years later, the station was purchased by Kennett and Avon Canal Trust and the restoration begins. In 1997, the chimney is restored. In 2019, Crofton Metronics project started and recently the electric pumps fell and Crofton was called to action. In summary, the station is 200 years old and it still works to this day. And thanks for watching! Why was Crofton built? Without Crofton, there'd be no water to pump up and they wouldn't be able to make the boats travel over the hill. Crofton was the best science for pumping water 200 years ago. It lives over 10 tonnes a minute, so it takes 20 minutes to, to fill full lock of water. Surprisingly, Crofton has worked for 200 years and is still capable of working now. Without Crofton, they cannot pump water, so the canal would, would never have worked. In this short video, we will be telling you what happened to the canal when the railways came. When the canal came, it was good when it came and was very popular for transporting goods such as coal, and brick. The railways came. The trains were even more popular than the boats and were good for transporting food like milk and apples. What happened to the canal? The, the canal went out of business when the trains came because people knew they could fit everything on a train. Even though the canal went out of business, Crofton was still used to pump water for the steam engines. Now, now that's, that's interesting. interesting. Why was Crofton still operating as the canal declined? Crofton Beam Engines battled through the decline of the canal. Is in Bald Kingdom, Brunel said. To improve the station, I will give you new boilers to create more steam and run our engine. In 1852, the Great Western Railway bought the canal because the canal was losing profit. Crofton pumps water to the top of the canal. That's why it is so helpful because the trains could refill their water tank as it runs out. The chimney was unstable, which is dangerous, and then a part of it got knocked down. Without the boiler and steam, the engines couldn't run and no water was being pumped. We hope you enjoyed our video and thanks for watching.